This clip is brought to you by SaveWithConrad.com. Uh, Joey Styles and Mick Foley are going to do commentary for the show. Mick was in ECW back in 95, but most fans remember that Joey Styles did commentary for the most part solo. You know, occasionally he would have uh, Don Callis or sorry, Cyrus, the virus or, or something like that. But for the most part, this was always Joey's show. Uh, how was Joey to deal with? I mean, we know that he's eventually going to wind up landing a deal and become uh, a part of the team for many, many years, but this is really what helps jumpstart all that. Right. From my point of view, Joey was always e easy to deal with. And uh, I thought Joey was a good commentator and as a human being, Joey was a stand up human being and hard worker. So, you know, he was always e easy to deal with. I think after this, he would pop up in November at uh, taboo Tuesday, he's brought in to fill in for Jonathan coachman and fast forward. He becomes a regular part of the team. I think sometime in January. So, uh, it worked out for, for Joey, if nobody else, it's worth mentioning. Mick Foley was also at Shane Douglas's uh, hardcore homecoming a couple nights before this, but the show begins with Joey styles coming to the ring to introduce the show. He's near tears. The crowd is chanting, Joey, Joey, Joey. This is one fired up crowd. Mick Foley is going to come to the ring with his old cactus Jack theme music. And then they play the classic uh, ECW intro video in our first match. Let's uh, also talk about Shane McMahon. It's been written over the years that Shane McMahon was a big ECW fan during their original run. Do you remember having conversations with Shane about ECW or maybe taking his temperature on what he thought of one night stand and, and the idea of doing a reunion show? Shane was a big fan of ECW and he, he enjoyed it. And just like the, the presentation of the show, the television show. So that was something that he followed. He watched it, uh, much more so than anyone else. And it, uh, you know, yeah, he liked it. I don't know that there was anything really more to it than that. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you get a notice anytime we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.